We are learning more details about contract negotiations between UW health officials, nurses, and union leaders that ultimately helped avoid a nurse's strike this week. You'll remember an agreement was reached after a weekend-long meeting at the governor's residence. Nurses then held a rally on Tuesday celebrating that groundbreaking agreement. And inside the room where it happened, two UW nurses are now describing those sometimes tense and always long negotiations that happened over the weekend. Our Naomi Coles has the story. Did the governor provide snacks? <laughs> <laughs> he provided me a Diet Coke. UW nurses have been celebrating since Sunday what went down last weekend to avoid a three-day strike this week. A deal struck here inside the governor's mansion. It was exhausting. Some points we were around the table, but we would caucus and it, it was like that for the, the, almost the whole night. Sunday, our last day, there was much more sitting around a table hashing things out. But two leaders acknowledged to me today, not everyone was or even is on board with the deal struck. That included We're Sherry still, Signer, who was one of the first you know, four the or meetings. five founders um, of the movement. Initial reactions, um, I, I was not overly happy on the initial reaction, but that's also because I didn't fully understand everything, um, what everything meant. There was a lot of confusion and I think there still is. I think people expected us to come out with complete union recognition, more money, you know, just immediate, immediate changes. The visuals in Monday's press conference of UW Health CEO, Dr. Alan Kaplan, appearing alongside the nurse leadership that he announced many times he wouldn't negotiate with, it's all still a bit surreal. It was pretty tense. I mean, we had to have a very good game face. What was it like to follow all of those announcements he put out and then all of a sudden be sitting across the table from him? It's, it's exciting and we're really happy that we have gotten our seat at the table. In Madison for News 3 Now, I'm Naomi Coles. Naomi will have much more on the inside details of the negotiations, what the nurses gave up to get what they got, and the legal details of how it's supposed to play out. All of that is in her longer conversation with the nurses, which airs this Sunday morning on For the Record at 1030.